First things first, Nico is fucking right. That's first of all. Second of all, bro, I do want to say one thing that's insane. Why are all these creators so scared to talk about fucking uh, 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 Chris Tyson, but they were so easy to talk about Dr. Disrespect? That just doesn't make any sense to me, bro. Don't say GG's chat. It shouldn't affect anything about the new direction we're going, but come on, I'm being real. Why are so many creators scared to tweet and talk about it, but they were so quick to put all these tweets about Dr. Disrespect? It's just insane. It's like obvious, chat, what's going on here. You know you fucking know. X, X, X is one person that's fair. He likes consistency. It doesn't matter who you are, your sexuality, your race, your gender, it don't fucking matter. If somebody's called out for being a and there's there was more proof on Chris than there was on Dr. Disrespect. Like, come on, I'm not saying too wrong. I'm not defending Dr. Disrespect. He's a pal too. But I'm just saying, like, there's literally more I, bro, I'm watching clips, bro. I'm like, what the f am I hearing right now, bro? Snapchat messages and shit. Dude, like it's 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 not it's not hard. It's not it's really not hard to be faithful, dude. It's um it's probably one of the easiest things in the world. You just, I mean, you just, like, like I don't tell you, it's not hard. <laughs> like, I don't tell you, I don't do that. I go, I go out of my way to make sure that I am never even alone in another room with a woman, ever, ever in any moment. Like, even like my, P, there was, even like my PR person, like, it, it doesn't matter who it is. I don't care if they work for me, whatever, bro. There is someone else in that room at all times. If we're alone, I leave instantly. That's like, that's on like fidelity, right? As for anything else, dude, it, it just, I don't DM anyone, bro. I DM my boys, like I DM like guys in the community. No, there's no private messages going on with any girls. If there are, it's some, it's like someone like Chica or like just like people in the space. And then I let my wife know. And then as for like the people that I know, bro, if I don't know you, I am not DMing you. I don't want to get to know you, dude. I don't want to find out you're only 17. Like, I don't know how to explain it, man. I'm also 33 years old. And like, you know, if I was freaking 19, 20 again, like, and I wasn't, you know, in an incredible relationship, it's, I don't know. Boom. He's weird, bro. That's weirdo. Weirdo. Weirdo, 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 weirdo. Yes, yes, weirdo. Yes, Chris from Mr. Beast, bro. It's fucked up. It's weird. It's weird, bro. It's weird. It's weird. I don't care. I said it's weird, bro. It's weird. Should that be it? it like, what a video? Let me get a, let me see the tweet, bro. Whatever the tweet, the video. I just heard it on some blogs and shit. I'm like, bro, what the fuck, bro? Like, what is going on, bro? Like, how do you see? How do you? How do you see? How do you know the age of someone, knowing that you're a grown ass man? And still move forward, but I don't understand it. I don't, bro. I don't, gang. Beast. My little brother used to watch you guys, Mr. Beast. I have a five-year-old brother who watches you guys, Mr. Beast. To find out that Chris is a fucking pedal f man. Do you know what that means to me? I have a little brother who watches you, Mr. Beast. I have a little brother who's five years old who watches you. You know how much that means to me, bro? That hurts my heart, bro. That hurts my heart, bro. You have a big following, Mr. Beast. You got trannies and fucking pedophiles in your shit, bro. Like, fix up, bro. What the fuck is going on? Like, Mr. Beast, I love your content. You know, my little brother watches you all day, bro. But finding this out, I hope he doesn't find that he was a pedophile, bro. Because you might lose a subscriber, bro. You just got to watch out for these pedophiles, bro. Watch your circle, bro. I don't about people talking about it. I just, I just don't get why everyone nowadays is so scared to talk about shit, bro. Speak your fucking mind. That shit is weird. He's weird in general. He's been weird, bro. It's just, I don't know, chat. Motherfucker. Nowadays, are so scared to just be open and speak your mind. I don't have any sponsorships. No one even likes me. Who gives a? F it, it's just the truth, man. Ava amid a gender scandal. Chris Tyson resigns from all positions related to Mr. Beast. Tyson has come under fire for allegedly engaging in inappropriate behavior with someone. Now 20 years old, the purported victim refutes the allegations. Ava, after making some recent accusations, Chris Tyson, a longtime member of the Mr. Beast YouTube staff, has departed the channel. Beginning on July 21st, rumors began to circulate that Tyson had previously conversed inappropriately with someone. Despite the fact that the person going by the handle Alava Giaz on X has refuted any wrongdoing during their interactions, Tyson was accused of behavior toward persons in further allegations that swiftly surfaced. Tyson has released a statement in light of these allegations. Tyson expressed regret for his previous conduct in a brief post on X, stressing that their purpose was never to do damage. Tyson did not attempt to deny or explicitly address any of the particular accusations. Tyson ended the statement by declaring their separation from Mr. All social media channels, including Beast's YouTube channel, should prioritize their family. 
it was stated that both parties agreed to break ways with Mr. Beast. I apologize to everyone I may have offended or injured with my previous behavior or remarks. I did not mean to do that, Tyson wrote. We both agree that, in light of recent occurrences, it would be better for me to completely cut off all ties to Mr. Beast and social media in order to prioritize my family and mental health. Jimmy Donaldson, or Mr. Beast, has not yet made a statement regarding Tyson's predicament. On social media, though, a number of streamers and content producers have chastised Tyson and urged Mr. Beast to take action. If Mr. Beast makes any statements, we will keep you informed. The allegations of inappropriate behavior with people in the previous month have been the subject of two high-profile cases, including this one. Streamer Doctor. Disrespect revealed in late June that he had messaged someone in 2017, which resulted in his enigmatic Twitch ban. Social media revelations about Ava Chris Tyson's problematic background and perhaps inappropriate interactions have come to light. We will proceed cautiously because this is a delicate topic and the interactions we are looking at are involved. It was recently disclosed that Ava has an odd fascination with particular kinds of art. A number of tweets and screenshots are included in the PRISM42 video, Ava's endorsement of a particular online artist. I will not name this artist out of respect for their privacy, but he is well known for his explicit paintings of well-known pop culture figures, some of whom are forbidden to be depicted in public. Eva seemed to be particularly interested in this genre. There are serious accusations here. Among the worst accusations that can be leveled is this one. Why then do people say this? Because Ava made their lives so much easier. Ava is interacting with the style of art in a number of tweets. A brief history of the artist is necessary to appreciate the significance of Ava's backing. This artist has worked with actual people, including a Spanish actress and Keemstar's daughter, in addition to depicting sexual scenes from fiction. His supporters are aware of these deeds. It does not improve the problem whether or not Ava knew about it. Ava's boastful tweet about having this artist's artwork on display in their living room served as the impetus for these discoveries. Ava then tweeted again, this time tagging the artist and including a photo of a print that included a picture of a child in it while others could counter that it could be purchased humorously, putting it on display at home seriously cast doubt on that idea. Screenshots from previous Mr. Beast videos reveal this artwork at Ava's house, which raises serious concerns. When it became evident that everyone watching Ava's house or taking part in those films would have seen this unsettling artwork, the issue became more heated. Additionally, Ava commented on a tweet featuring artwork of Gravity Falls' Dipper and Mabel saying, since they are twins, it is basically just like playing with yourself, right? These kinds of tweets are quite common. Ava was an adult at the time of everything, adding to the worrying nature of the behavior. Not to be overlooked is the new revelation regarding Ava's perhaps inappropriate relationship with an individual. How do you feel about these scenarios that keep happening? Finding out that accusations were exaggerated was once frequent. Now, however, the evidence is frequently indisputable. Maybe the terrible actors are finally being weeded out. Hopefully the content creators that are still active on this site are sincere and courteous. Please hit the like and subscribe buttons if you like this video. It benefits the channel and is free.